Hello. A little while ago we uh, got a Q Scout robot and uh, built that and that was fun. And so for the holidays, my son got the Q Dino robot. From you. From me. And we're going to build that today and see how that goes and then let you know what we think. Who's that? Tristan. It's a Squishmallow, I'm pretty sure. All right, sure. so Tristan's so, like, gonna watch us build this and then uh, we'll catch up with you after the build. was a little bit tough. Like you have to go like to try to find where they go. That, that's to so be I would, I think the rating that they have on the app is probably about right. That it's um, a four out of five in terms of build. Uh, he's seven. And so definitely needed some help in getting this built. Um, but the instructions are, are pretty good. Definitely better than some. Um, there's a couple places that they could maybe be improved, but uh, generally pretty straightforward and um, seems pretty durable. I think the arms we need to tighten up. Yeah, because um, like they literally just drag yeah, down. Yeah, because otherwise they're people. dragging, so I think we need to tighten we this up. We need to like go like this or something. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to like do something. 
But but other than that, all the pieces fit together well. Um, it doesn't work to move. It's pretty pretty hard to like get it to get perfectly set up and everything. Okay, but um, similar to the Q Scout, um, it seems pretty straightforward to build. I think the build time was about right, probably a little bit a little bit over an hour for us um, to do. Uh, but we will be back and show you a little bit of the driving action. Once we get it to work.